A little too much heat on it and out out of bounds, so this will turn over. And Santa Cruz getting their first possession of the day. Yeah. 
for Santa Cruz, gets that ball just before going out of bounds, but she's got two defenders, gets pushed out, so she'll keep possession. Actually, they're gonna turn this over. So they might be thinking she stepped out on her own there rather than getting pushed. Turns the ball over to the Cougars. Training line. Cougars recover. Back behind goal line extended. Going to work for Max. Got that ISO opportunity. Shot and goal. Cougars get this draw control. Driving in. Drawing the foul. So Cameron Kinsey, the freshman attacker out of San Marcos, going to be getting this free position shot against Jordan Philman in the cage. Defending for the slugs. Well defended by Santa Cruz. Save. 
Alonzo Trapaca looking for another one, but Jordan Fieldman. Getting a nice high below Reed. Cradle, but Cougars holding on to it. That's going to be a quick offsides call, just stepping over the restraining line trying to get that ball. Nice. The slugs finally getting possession here. Ball immediately checked out, but continuing to get whistles. Cougars finally slowing it down here. Gonna settle out the attack. Nice look, but not able to execute. Ground ball. Even through some defenders, has a look in front of from Temecula.
circle and running around the back side there, so that's going to be a turnover. Wide open, there you go. Good job, Sierra! Sierra has her target wide open in midfield. Perfect pass. Next one. Not hitting the mark, out of bounds. All the way across the field and turning back over to Santa Cruz. Defense coming out, slowing them down. Good news of the last, this time number 15, Eden Betancourt, the graduate of track out of Modesto, California, getting her first of the day. Three minutes and 40 seconds to play here in this first quarter. This Division II championship game. Still looking for the first drop and draw. They've got it there. Go, Eddie! Go, Eddie! Hey, Angela! You got it, Angela! Roll dodge, passes it off. Oh, great shot, great save. Jordan Fieldman coming up with some fantastic saves here. Keeping this score differential from getting out of reach for the slugs. Gets a cause turnover, trying to run through a wall of defenders. Keepers on the ride, but Santa Cruz able to keep control and get this spark cleared out finally. Ball finding its way back into a Cougar stick and San Marcos on the move quickly over to their attacking third. Both teams struggling a little bit at the moment with ball control. Looks to be cleaning that up a little bit here and setting up a play coming from in outside the 12. Not that pass back ball. Bounces inside the goal circle. Feldman clearing it out.
clock at 30 seconds. San Marcos with possession. Can we looking to get one more shot off before the buzzer? We're at 10 seconds. Great defense from the slugs crashing in. Really defending well. And with that, clock hits zero.
starting to get a very light rainfall here on the field. Much cooler day than yesterday. Really just your typical SoCal weather for April.
Santa Cruz still looking for the opportunity, taking their time. Officials taking a moment to discuss and how to administer the penalty here. It looks like this is going to be a free position restart outside at the 12. above the players heads as required and the officials award an alternate possession this time going to the Cougars. Yellow 
card there. I think that stick came up and yep, just made a little contact. Contact with the face of the San Marcos player, so that's going to be a two minute releasable yellow card against the slugs. Cougars will have that player up advantage for the next two minutes. Unless they score, at which point that penalty would then be released and slugs will be back to even strength. Slugs just doing everything they can to try to slow down the San Marcos attack. Of course, doing it a player down now. Go behind! Your defense! Come on! Pick it up, Carly! Pass high. Slugs can get control, then they can try to run out this penalty. Get her, Jess! Get her, Jess! Get her! There you are, Most of these 50-50 rolls seem to be going San Marcos' way. That pass a little too high, it's gonna go out. And there's the opportunity for Santa Cruz. Still got some time left on this penalty. Defenders get a stick on it. Job, send it high out the back side, backed up by the Cougars. Another shot sailing out of bounds. Good D, good D, let's go! And the penalty's been released to Santa Cruz back to even strength. Great save. Down to a minute 32 in this first hey, Jill, half. Give Exactly right play there, getting that check of 
turnover passing to the open player in front of the cage, but Gilman makes a big stop. So starting the second half here, Cougars with the draw control again. Turn back over to San Marcos. Taking their time. Their attack starting to spread out more than we saw in the first half. Using more space on this field, spreading out this slugs defense. A left hand shot out the left side of the cage, and I think Feldman really got a stick on that. Far, great adjustments here from this slugs defense. Cougars really moving this ball around, forcing this defense to slide and keep up. Getting the whistle. Angela Sintaka gets this free position opportunity. Shot out the feet of Feldman. Great look there, a shot just sails a little wide right. Sam Marcos bringing it back in. Continue to get a little bit of light rain and mist here. With this you see. Assisted by Callie Price getting her second of the day. And here at 
Triton Stadium at UC San Diego. Like we may have had an early entry from the banana slugs there and they award this draw over to the Cougars. <laughs> so the foul sets up Angela Kentaka for another free position shot opportunity off the eight meter. Fires one, looking for that bottom right of the net. Just missed, 9.40 on the clock. over to San Marcos. We're looking through four defenders. Doug's finally able to find an escape. They continue to struggle against this tough San Marcos ride to transition the ball. So turns back over. And we've got another offsides call. Turns over to the slugs again. Ball down in front of the cage. Feldman coming out trying to help out with their team, but Cougars holding on to possession. Great defensive response there from the Slugs. Eventually Cougar is coming up with it.
Roxy Strims joining this hat trick club with Angela Tintaka and Jillian Dorman. Gelman pass coming over the goal, goal circle. Contact there, no card. Mary Handler gets this free position eight meter shot. Very safe, very safe by Feldman. Post. Get a rebound, let's go! The pressure on her! Watch your reaction. Jordan Gilman going to slow walk this ball upfield. Finds a target. Quick stick. Just nick either the stick or the left post there. Feldman may have gotten a little touch on that ball. And Cougars finally coming up with the ground ball.
for this draw win. over on their attacking third.
Sierra coming up with a big save off that free position shot. Official calls a trip. I think that was inadvertent, but nevertheless, Cougars get the foul and we start play. Go back in, Carly, go back in! Great check there by the slugs. start on that one so it's not alternate possession they're saying that the slugs draw taker moved early here against San Marcos. Or maybe just 
just a warning from the official there. Potentially delay a game if they're not moving behind in a timely manner. Nice catch. One of the better transitions we've seen today from the slugs. They able to string together a series of passes. And over on their attack, chance to settle it out. Looking for the shot. Save. Sierra Warfield coming up with a great save. Up kill. Down for the ground ball. Down Santa Cruz direction. Check there, contact with the head. Look at that, Julian Dorman heading out for two minutes. So they're not inadvertent. You see her checking to make sure that the Santa Cruz player was okay. But mandatory card nonetheless from the official. to finally put one in the back of the net here. Comes in, loses the cradle, gets the whistle, so get another attempt at this. So Brown gets a chance again from the second inside pass. around the defender. Ball comes Two out minutes. into the crease. And Sierra Warfield gets a pass up field. Great ground ball from the slugs. 
Stays in bounds, got a one-on-one -on -one ground ball battle. In the back corner of the field, Cougars coming up with it. Both teams just looking a little rushed here, trying to get control and get another shot before the clock hits zero. Got a whistle, clock at 122. Working through a couple of defenders. Clock at a minute. One, minute. One more opportunity here. Come on, T! Get set up! Woo! They're gonna call a charge there. Honestly, a little surprised at that, but that's going to turn the ball over to the Cougars. Thank <laughs> you. 